Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to part 13 of Let's Play The Best Money Can Buy. So let's continue with what we were doing, which was pretty much just um, messing with the uh, uh, the Westlands before we eventually leave the Riverlands for a little bit. Uh, probably flee Crashy for a, quite a while because I don't see me staying with them. Also, apparently, my dumbass has continually renamed everything wrong. No, oh, off centaur, off centaur, off centaur, off centaur, off centaur. Oh, damn it. Nearly did it again. Oh, wait, this is better from in. How is it? I didn't spell infantry room and. Yeah, infantry Yeah, oh, fuck off. I didn't spell infantryman wrong, but I did indeed spell the, you know, the other thing wrong. The axeman. Yeah, they both have the 206, so I did fix that. Okay, good. So I do apologize. If you guys are like commenting well ahead, uh, you know, on videos like part eight and nine, I do apologize as I'm recording these. You know, I tried to record at least a week in advance. Uh, well. At least is current. I say at least because at the moment all I've been able to do is get pretty much weeks in advance. So yeah, um, that is probably why you're you're thinking, oh, Joe, you've already just fixed this, yeah? Because I have, I didn't honestly know until you told me, and then I, you know, recorded a new session. We're like, well, fuck. Uh, they don't want to fight me, although they did just take twenty extra troops. Where the hell? Oh, they must have took prisoners. Yeah, just go get Joanna Hill. She needs to go back into prison. It's been a it has been a while, and I decided you're going to go back in prison. Uh, I don't know when we started, uh, you know, doing the work for um, the Rivaland, so we, we are going to need to check. Because we can't be here can't be here for too long. Because that's just rude. Are they coming towards me? They do indeed seem to be. So we'll just let our men deal with this. Oh, beautiful platinum. Platinum lances, man. Beautiful. Our heavy infantry just sat at the front. Crossbowmen sat, you know, ready to plink at everyone who comes near. And even more platinum lances and my wife. Who doesn't really look right yet, but she'll get there. She'll get a platinum lance armor at some point. Or actually, you know, probably I'll give her a Lannister armor so she fits in with me even better. Now, I don't really need to give a shit about my, um, my kills anymore. As, uh, well, we've already, uh, what's, uh, what's the way to phrase it? We've already, um, we've hit the, uh, the level I wanted to hit, so I'm not fussed about leveling up anymore. Doesn't mean I'm not gonna, you know, attempt to kill this guy. Oh, you wanna fight with Sword and Shield? Alright. Aww. Eh, be alright. We'll just keep letting our guys shoot. Like I said, the best way to mitigate issues on, you know, keep doing what we'll, you know, what we wanna do is, uh, Take them out with take them out as quickly as possible with ranged weapons and uh cash in. Or cash out technically, because you know. We we we're just here for the money, literally. I do think I had other rules and I need to double check them. You know, while uh, my men are dealing with that force that's nowhere near close enough, let's have it unchecked. Yeah, I am following all the little, little rules. Good for me. And our cavalry to the flanks as well. I mean, why not, you know? Okay, crossbow, you can stop shooing now. There we go. Let's see if she can remember to block me. I'll take that as a no. No, no, she will not remember block that is crying shame as i believe they say <laughs> yeah insult to injury right there two left come on get them dead okay, they're not cavalry so they can't be begin far away and yeah, we'll let the oh no they, i was gonna say we'll let the other one get away but no nope, but they killed them there we go in prison you go what top tier troops have you got for me Nine of them. Can't complain. Um, we don't need crossbows, right? No, we do. Well, yeah, we're going to go up to 40, 55 crossbows, I've decided. I've decided purely because, you know, I just... We've got a lot of infantry and, you know, five more... Ooh. 
There we go. Now she at least has Lannister armor on, which is going to look good. She can also put that. I know it, like, kind of gets in, but I think it'll look a lot better than uh, what she's currently got. Uh, do we have... Yeah, she's already got Wax Archer boost. So, I mean, she's basically just ready to fight. She already has a fine Lannister helmet. So, you know, she's uh, on point. Uh, spear Bracing. She already has a Spear Bracing one. Well, fair enough. Uh, we will be hiring some companions soon. And of course, I haven't decided when or, you know, I haven't really decided when we're going to be hiring them. It's going to be the best way to put it. Because we want to be in a position where we have loads and loads of money. And currently, we only have one person in prison, so we're going to need a few more. Uh, we do have more than enough money uh, to what I was going to do. Uh, as I did say, like, you know, uh, I wanted uh, 250 grand before I went back to the Westlands. But, uh, well, as you all know, we can't go to the Westlands currently. Good point, though. We should double-check when we joined the, uh... It was in 301, at the very least. So we'll say to the end of this year, we can stay here. After that, we have to leave. So we, as long as we don't engage any extra armies, we can technically stay a little longer. But uh, we, we just have to cash out any lords we've got and then go. That's how we're going to do it. Oh, fuck. I missed all the lords who were going to come. I missed all the lords as they came over. Because we don't want to get attacked. Or don't want to be chased by that guy. Tara Brack. Uh, sorry, Tina. Ooh, Tina Brax. There she is. Stop there. Uh, I have stopped. You and me. And let's uh, see us tango. There's going to get a point where a point where wars are going to get a little bit more annoying. And I'm all here for it. Will to enemy. They keep coming to me for some reason. I do not know why. I can't say it's their most intelligent thing they've ever done, but... Oh, well. I trust my cavalry. Sorry, me infantry as well. Make a shield wall. Are you going to get your spears out? Nope, my spearmen do not seem to wield their spears ever. Okay. Yeah, charge the men. Infantry. Nope, there we go. Go back to line formation and charge. Right, there we go. Right, so everyone is now or have have uh, they've got their uh, orders. Everything should be a nice, simple, uh, be a nice, simple affair now. There we go. We do need to get our wife the uh, lion shield so I can tell her apart. Because at the moment, the biggest issue when it comes to telling my wife apart is not the armor, because I know that the only two people in Lannister armor are me and my wife on our side, on horseback. The issue is, um, what's it called? Uh, the shield. The shield, because she's got a normal shield, I can't, it's harder to tell her apart. Uh, we good on their end? We good? Yep, we're good. Five men wounded, but no death. That's, uh... Well, it's, uh, it's, it's, a good, it's a good outcome, I'd say. Good outcome indeed. Oh, she had some good troops as well, so that's even more good men for us. Uh, went up to 53 of you. Well, let's get one of you, why not? More, some Lannister braces. Uh, she has Castle Rock braces, though. Lannister braces actually go better with this, so I'll just give her that. There we go. Okay. Hey, we had a baby. It's our first baby, so we get, we have to watch. Okay. I do apologize. I talked about my drink. It was, uh, it was very rude of me. Now, did we have a son or a daughter? Uh, a Magella. I'm going, I'm going to say out loud. I'm going to very much guess that's a woman. Uh, hello, Gareth Griff. Uh, Griff Yours is not hey, Clifton, there we go. What army you got, bud? Oh. The only real thing, they have a Bannonite, and that's... Oh, 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 oh. 
Oh no, this is mean. Question is, are they going to try and come to me? No, they're not good. Alright, let's get these guys across one by one then. Everyone, ready yeah, as soon as I, I saw this bridge, I was I was thinking if they come to me, they are dead. Infantry! Infantry come here. Move! Move! Once the infantry are across, we can get the cavalry across, and then we'll get the uh, archers across uh, crossbow across. God, look at those gorgeous troops. Yeah, we have a lot more cavalry, so we're fine. And I also pretty sure our cavalry is as good as Banner Knights in terms of shock. But I'm pretty sure. Actually, I don't even know if we're better in. Yeah, I think we are. We will probably suffer from the same issue Banner Knights suffer from as a unit. Is that we're not technically um. We're not technically anything but shock cavalry. So this could bite us in the uh, no the long term, but I don't see it being a problem. Beautiful horses. Archers! Move! Foot forward! Now, the most important part, technically, is our crossbows, uh... Our crossbows are damn good. Just gotta hope for them to get across. If it wasn't a bridge, obviously, we'd be there by now, but because bridges, if you don't run your men across bridges, like, one at a time, they, they, just, they typically just get stuck and the pathing gets really weird. Like, the path thing's already weird that they're all decided they want to be this close to the fucking wall. Like, I know they're going over in, that dire in the direction over there. But, like, why do they need to be glued to one another's sides? Cavalry are all over there. Looking nice and good. Archers! Forward! Yeah, crossbow get over here. Infantry move! here. Cavalry move! Cav move! Bowman! Hold fire! Yeah, do not shoot yet, you little buggers. Bowman! Forward! And move! If they shoot too early, they're gonna start pissing about and not be in a good position. Also, I feel like we're always gonna have, like, really low rank crossbowmen sometimes. Uh, as well, like, I'm gonna have loads of good ones and just a couple of bad ones, because the good ones always end up doing all fire the work. Infantry! Cavalry! Forward! Horse forward! Alright, are they gonna come to us? They probably will, so let's just... We'll keep an eye on them. Our infantry line's a little bit skinny because we had it in, uh, you know, we we elongated it on the bridge after we, uh... oh, sorry, we elongated it in shield wall. So when you put it into normal wall, it gets even longer. They don't seem to really be, uh... Cavalry, cavalry, move, yeah, I'm going to get group four over there. Horsemen, move! Arrows! We are shooting technically for a like a group like a tree line, so the tree line could be the problem. Archer, footman, cavalry, and move. Riders, riders, move. Cavalry, forward. Yeah, we'll keep our men nice and close. That way, our cavalry can immediately intercept enemy enemy cavalry when necessary. This pretty much means we can just chill here and just be an absolute douche to these guys. Why the hell is an off-center infantry right at the front line? Like, one of the one of the shitty units. You really should not be at the front. And yeah, they do not seem to. Yeah, we've killed six of them, but they do not seem to want to maneuver. There we go. The cavalry is going to immediately just get trounced. They have a ranged unit. Yeah, they didn't have much. They had like five crossbows to begin with, so. I'll pull the crossbowmen back, so that way our infantry do their job. One flank of cavalry already dead. 
Deccan Flank's on its way out. And the infantry ain't gonna last much longer either. They did kill two of my Platinum Lancers, though. Good for them. And I mean actually kill, so we're gonna have to re-recruit those. I am looking forward to doing bigger battles, but we... I won't be doing bigger battles until we personally get to a big enough force that we can do them easily. I mean, I could join other, like, I could join other battles, like, you know, that are going well, but I, ref I again, we're a mercenary. We ain't going to join battles that are going poorly. It's just not us, you know? Reinforced plating. We're going to keep those because they're expensive and they're worth, I think they're worth keeping. Uh, Lambert game charm. Good for me. Good for me. Uh, that's three lords, correct? I remember. Um... I don't want to. I don't give a shit about my healing. What? Okay, so I have to look here. Oh, yeah, it's free lords. Uh, able to go chuck these lords in prison. I mean, I know we've still got time left, but I don't want to go get myself new armor. So as much as I like making money, we're gonna go chuck this in. Chuck these dipshits in prison, and then we're gonna leave. Eh, not as much as I could have got. So who's this guy? Uh. He is a Valyrian Devious Bastard. Uh, it's got loads of good skills. Sure, sure you can be... Uh, Your health. You're going to be our next uh, commander. Uh, yeah, I still need two cavalry, I believe. Wait, wait. I lost two. Oh, I have no... Wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Let me, I'll have to count them in a minute. So let's just get two... Before we buy anything, so let's, get, let's count them. So we've got 41 there. 43. Yeah, we're missing two. He's an infantryman, isn't he? Yeah, he's an infantryman. That's why he doesn't count. Right, okay, good, good. We'll go sell stuff. Well, first things first, let's just wait out our time quickly. You know, we've earned this money. Once it become, once it stops being enough to actually pay for my garrison, that's when we'll, uh, we'll leave. Because any extra at that point isn't really math doesn't really matter, you know. Buy the wood. That we good on every. Yeah, we we've got a pretty good supply of uh, stuff to be fair. Lannister officer, am I what? Wife of mine. This dipshit. Um. I mean. Yeah, they're even they're better than what I've got. I mean, we'll, we'll be getting rid of them as soon as we need to. Uh, I mean, the only thing you need to get rid of is your Valyrian plates. Uh, we'll get rid of those with that for now. Yeah, we're, go we're going to be going there anyway, so it's not going to matter. And there we go. Well, it was lovely working for you. Uh, it was a bit boring after a, for a while, but uh, after a while, but uh, you know. And by a bit boring, I mean, you know, we, we just we just kept winning and it just, just wasn't necessary, was it? All right, the Linus port. Let's go get ourselves, hopefully, some Linus the Noble armor. That is my goal, is to get the Linus the Noble armor. Nope, Linus their armor, Linus the Soldier armor too. What the fuck is that? Looks the exact same, cool. All right, let's, uh, so I've got Linus the House pauldrons. Some heavy pauldrons. So first things first, my wife needs... Well... You know, what? we're gonna go check case first before we uh, before we like you know uh, just take whatever's on, on offer. We're gonna go to case because our uh, our vassals are gonna be in the officer armor definitely. Well, they could just give more. Oh, there we go, Lannister house pauldrons. That's my wife's. There we go. Lannister open helm. We'll give that to this dipshit. I mean, I do actually like the open one to be fair quite a bit. I uh, will also buy him Linus the Officer Armor. Uh, braces wise, I mean, as far as I'm concerned, it would be, I would prefer Linus to plate gloves for him. So, get rid of that. And I'm still fucking paying. Are you kidding me? Damn. I do not have that much money, apparently. Oh, I have loads. Of, sorry, I do not. I did not have that much loot on me. I have money, though. Uh, you need a two handed sword, correct? Yeah, correct. Uh, you good with, like, one-handed or anything? First things first, I need... He needs a lion shield. 
and you'll need a lion shield. I don't give a shit that you're not good. Yeah, you are good with one handed. You're good with one handed to two handed. You're not. You're not bad at riding either, actually. So let's give you. Destria, maybe. Wait, what, what is my wife on? My wife is on a horse that's a lot faster, but not as maneuverable. I'm on a better horse. So we'll give him that. We'll give him this. There we go. So he's fully equipped in that regard. Swords. Let's give him... I'll give him a heavy knight lance, and then we'll give him... Weirdly enough, they don't have the Lannister sword here, which is hilarious, because that's what I would give him. Uh, the only other thing we're missing, unfortunately, is his shoulder armor and his uh, pauldrons. We can't really go out. He can't really go just yet, which is a shame. But uh, once he's fully equipped, we can send him to... Like, once he gets those two uh, and a sword, he can actually... Like, as far as I'm concerned, officer armor is as good as they need. You know, we, we are good there. I think we may have to just serve the uh, the Westlands for a while. Just so I'm I have a place to come and get stuff. So I can, you know consistently get uh, what I want instead of thinking oh I have to wait to the end of the you know end of this uh end of my service of these dipshits yeah we had they had Linus to house pauldrons I mean say that's near enough good enough and Linus to braces with gloves that's I'd say that is actually good enough yeah Linus to braces with gloves is what he's gonna what they're gonna wear and maybe give them... Yeah, we'll give them the heavy pauldrons. This is going to be... Yeah, he's equipped. He just needs his sword. And there is a Lannister sword here, luckily. So there we go. Uh, this is our uh, second in command now. Now, by second in command, obviously, I mean, you know, second... Wait, wait. My wife just has a knight's lance. And he has a heavy knight's lance. Doesn't matter. There we go. Good. <laughs> like, why the hell does she not have a good weapon? Um, You got any uh, wood? No? Let's buy all you. We could buy beer, but honestly, we have way too much beer. And he buys the beer anyway. There we go. Uh, are we hurting? We are actually hurting now. Um. Hmm. We shouldn't be hurting that much. <sighs> Fine. Go back down to three eighty. We'll go. We'll go to four hundred. That's as much as I'm going down to, damn it. There we go. Still hurting? We are still technically hurting. Well, fuck it. I want my horse back. I'm going to go back up to 160. There we go. Right. As far as I'm concerned, he is now ready to get gone. So off you go. And the only problem is we're going to need to defend him. This is like the only real issue that's going to come out of this. For until he's at uh, 100 troops, we're going to have to defend him. And even then, probably still worthwhile to defend him. Worst thing is he's only grabbing infantry right now, which is definitely not great for him. Uh, let's make sure he's aggressive, because, you know, it would make sense. As soon as he's got troops, we'll go from there. So his dumb ass thought that he could take out though. It's because he's because I'm following him. He was like, oh, I could take those out. I, you're with me. Ugh, what a dipshit. Luckily, I get full control over his troops. Bowman! Forward! It move, move, cavalry, forward, cavalry, move, soldier, uh. forward. But lucky this is bandits, and we can just uh, you, we you, we know for a fact that just sitting here is going to be perfectly fine. Archers. And we've got sixty of them. Uh, how many crossbows? Does he have? he has seven crossbowmen already. He's already elected to get crossbows, which I can't say it's a bad idea. To be fair, you know, there's part of me that's like, oh, that's probably not the best idea, but. Yeah, I don't know if how, how well our crossbows are going to break this guy, but uh, I'll break these. Uh... Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't know how well they're gonna break them, but we're gonna do what we can, obviously. Will they kill anyone is the question. Hmm. Nah, we'll let our infantry do with it. And we send our infantry and cavalry, it'll just get done quicker. And we also have less chance of losing in men, which is just what we, you know, what is most important there. But after this, we'll get ourselves, uh, once this army is like ready to go, we'll sign ourselves up with a brand new, uh, well, you know, we'll sign ourselves up for a brand new war and, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll join the Westlands for a while, you know, we'll get, we'll get, we'll get them some, uh, what's it called, some revenge for all the, uh, imprisonings we've done. That's not, that's actually not bad, like, five renown for that, still surprisingly. You're welcome. I mean, I'm technically your boss, so if my dumbass didn't help you, I, uh, well, I'd only be hurting myself, as they say. Yeah, I still need two more crossbows, and I can't actually get them, which is annoying. That's gonna annoy me for a while. Saving. There we go. Follow this dipship. Once he gets to like a hundred troops, he'll be fine. He just needs to get to that hundred troops and and then stop sucking, you know, after that. And like stop sucking with how he deploys. I'm my wife's pregnant again. This is about right. He also does not seem to want to go for there we go. He's now actually gonna go get some noble troops. He now has nine cavalry. That's what I like to see. Nine golden recruits. Yeah, the golden. Okay, he's now able to look after himself a little bit. Good. He did take quite some heavy losses there, but... If you get him to 100 men, he should be fine. I mean, we're only following him uh, till the end of this part to make sure he's, you know, not screwing himself over. This 75 troops is probably enough. 21, come on. 3... One more. And we go. I can leave you alone now. Good lad. I believe in you. What did I level up? I leveled up you. Awesome. So, uh, horses or mules? Uh, I mean, this is technically better, but I'd prefer... You know, fuck, we'll go for that. Te I, I like the technically because I will be buying horses more often. So, realistically, I should actually take my own advice and, you know, take the one that allows me to get horses cheaper. All right, as long as it's... <coughs> Sorry. Oh, yeah, that... That really caught me on my throat. Apologies. Uh, as long as his dumbass does his job right, uh, we should be good. That's, that's a Lannister. Is there a... There's Lance. Hello, Lancel. It's been... Too fitty. Fuck you. That is lower. Okay, let's go find... Wait, wait. But Marcella, how much are you paying? Peace to you. Yes, I get it. You're you're not technically really old enough. Oh, wow. Too... F well, okay. I literally now have a companion. You're, will you're only willing to pay... Fucking, I think you're actually paying less than the Rivlins were paying me. Oi, Gregor. Peace to you. You definitely do not sound like Gregor. Oh, so he's offering me 260. Okay, that's interesting. Where the fuck is Tywin? He's near Crown Stair. Okay. Uh, don't really want to go for a walk just yet. Let's, uh, let's just quickly uh, see if there's noble armor yet or... No, still only light armor. Not the shit. Yeah, I think we're good though. To be fair, I think every, I think we've got everything we need. My wife. The only thing she's missing is her gauntlets, but yeah, they don't really have the right ones, like the plate ones. We'll go check case one more time, and then we'll, you know, we'll we'll join up with someone again. I mean, it's not like we're, it's not like them breaking, we're breaking the bank and being like, oh, we have to go to war. Oh, Lannister Noble Pauldron. Yes, they are beautifully better. They're just so much better. That. Yeah, still can't find the plate gold gauntlets. Gauntlets seem to be like, the actual plate gloves seem to be the hardest to find so far. Though the fact that I've only just found noble pauldrons, which are the really good looking ones, they're those ugly things. Um, yeah, that's really good. So we'll buy those. Um, 
Okay, let's, uh, you know, we'll end this, and then the next part we'll go join up. Uh, we'll see what Tywin offers us, and we'll, uh, if he doesn't offer us anything good, we'll go join someone else. But until then, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do follow me on YouTube. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a share. But most importantly, guys, stay safe. Have a great day. Join the channel membership if you're interested, and I'll see you on the next one. See you guys then.